And then the next part is how to do the menu adjustment. And for the menu, we have the, that is three stage of the menu. The first one is group. The second one is a category. And the third one is item. So let's, uh, for a menu, we, uh, we have, for example, lunch, dinner, or you can eat. There are groups. And under groups, under uh, lunch group, we have some chicken category, beef category, or veggie category. And under uh, the category, under chicken category, we have some general Charles chicken, orange chicken, or crispy chicken. And if you want to add a group, we just go to the group. If you want to add the category, we just go to the category. And if you want to change some items, price items name, we can just uh, choose a item. And let's go to the um, demo to see how to do that. And in one menu, we have the menu group here, milk tea group, or the menu group. Under the group, we have this button is category. And under the category, we have this button, they are item. And if, one, if you want to edit each of them, first thing we need to go to the admin page to go to the second row, first one, the menu. And click menu, we have this page. First thing we need to choose uh, which menu we want to edit. If you want to edit the POS menu, we just choose this POS menu. I click this plus sign to expand all of the group under it. And if you want to add the group, you can just check one of the group and click this uh, pencil button. And in this page, you can add the group's name and the group's hours. For example, if there's a lunch group, you can just um, limit the lunch hour here and click the save. And then if you want to um, add the category, so we just choose which category you want to add it. If this category is on the order menu, we just click all day menu and it, it, it will show all of the category under it. And just check the category you want to add it and click this pencil button. And you can uh, edit the category's name and the tax. And then if you want to uh, add the uh, item, the first thing you need to uh, click the category that the item under it. For example, if you want to uh, add some signature bowl, we need to click the signature bowl and we will have all of the items under it and choose one of them, the bowl. We can add the item's name, the item's price, and uh, which printer you want to send this item to. And after adding all of them, you can click the save to save it. And if you want to create a new item, you can click this create new and enter the item's name, item's price. And if you want to send this item to the kitchen, you can click this in the kitchen record and choose which printer you want to send it to. Uh, same thing after you choose all of the menu adjustment and back to the main page, it will show refresh has been done. And then you can go to the menu page to check all of the things. And if you want to only just uh, add, add some item or category, we have a function named quick edit mode. Click the right up corner, this menu button. We have this menu edit mode, quick edit. Click here we have the same page that we can quick edit the menu. And if you want to add 
add a new category, you can, uh, in this category area, click this plus sign, then you can add the new category. And if you want to add a new item, so first thing you just need to, to choose a category you want to add a new item. For example, if you want to add a new item to kids' favorite, we just choose kids' favorite, then click the quick edit and click this item plus sign and enter name, price, and choose a printer to send the item. For example, if you want to do this kids, and type the price here, and choose a printer to say the custom to send this item to, and click the OK. And after you finish this edit, just click this quote edit mode and then we have this new new item and this is uh, uh, how to do the manual adjustment